meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. Well, those clouds are developing and also moving in on the western horizon, so we'll see increasing clouds through the evening, 56 at 7 o'clock, uh, 53 degree rating at 9 o'clock, down to 50 at 11 p.m. Uh, we'll head down into the 40s tomorrow morning and late tonight and into tomorrow morning, some rain moving in, and there could even be some thunder and lightning around the area, too. 49 degrees at noon and 55 at 5 o'clock, so cool day on the way for tomorrow. But tonight, increasing clouds with that chance of a late night shower. Cooler tomorrow, we had a high to Day of 60, only expecting readings in the mid 50s and below normal temperatures this week. This morning, bottoming out at 32 in Lima, 33 here in Dayton, but some of the outlying areas colder than that. Uh, 31 at uh, Lunkin Airport in Cincinnati, but CVG hit 30 and tied a record low this morning. And John Kingham, our weather checker up in Tip City, had ice in the rain gauge this morning, 28 the overnight low, and a heavy frost reported there. But otherwise, this afternoon, temperatures warming up nicely, upper 50s and low. 60s. Now, the average date of our last 32 is April 19th. We've got a 10% chance after May 3rd, and farther north up toward Bell Fountain, about a 10% chance mainly after May 11th. That's why we usually tell you don't plant those mothers, those flowers until Mother's Day, uh, which is coming up this Sunday. Low temperatures tonight, mid and upper 30s over the eastern Miami Valley, upper 40s in the southwestern and western counties. And you think you can pick up the warm front tomorrow? Should make it to the 80s out over central and Southern Illinois, Southern Indiana too, but then only 57 at Muncie and about 55 here in the Dayton area as we'll have that rain cooled air around. The time lapse on the stall vision camera, you can see the sunny skies about three hours ago, but already those clouds starting to move in and even actually just develop uh, right over western Ohio. We're still dry here this evening, but back west, some rain's been breaking out into eastern Illinois and out into Indiana. There's that warm front, 80s today out into Missouri while we've been in in the cool air. We're up to 61 degrees. That's now our high for the day. A northwest wind at 8 miles per hour. But check out that low relative humidity at 30 percent. So increasing clouds this evening will stay on the cool side. Watch the rain break out. Start to move toward the area late tonight and into tomorrow morning. We'll have some of the rain around showers, maybe even a rumble of thunder, and still the chance of some showers tomorrow evening. But then this system passes south and east of us uh, tomorrow evening. Wednesday looks mostly dry, although once again, going Going into Wednesday night and also Thursday, that rain could come back. Clouding up tonight, we'll see some of that late night rain dropping down to 44 degrees with light variable winds. Periods of rain tomorrow, cloudy and cool, the high only up to 55 degrees tomorrow afternoon. And of course, with no sunshine and that rain, it'll feel pretty raw out there. 40s in the morning, mid 50s at 4 and 6 o'clock. 66 the high on Wednesday, we'll have a slight chance of showers, but a better chance of rain again on Thursday and 60. 7 degrees, mostly cloudy Friday, 65. Could see a shower or thunderstorm mainly Saturday afternoon as the cold front moves in. And then behind that front, we dry out early next week. Mother's Day, upper 60s and partly cloudy skies. 72 on Monday with partly cloudy conditions. So it looks uh, pretty good once we get to Mother's Day. But before we get there, a little more rain on the way hmm. tomorrow. Yep.